What's up, people? This is Jack Wells here with another video for you all on the life of shrimp. These beautiful shrimp live for only two years. They have a very short lifespan. By the time they reach the end of the line, they give birth to hundreds of baby shrimplets, and that's how the colony moves forward. In this video, I've covered the different phases of life the shrimp goes through. I've kept the video short and crisp and covered all the major topics. Feel free to jump to whichever section you'll want. It is really hard to spot the gender of the shrimp when they're juveniles. And as the shrimp grows, it's easier to find the difference between a male and a female. If we can stop right here, now, that is a male shrimp. A very common trait to spot the male shrimp is it doesn't have an underbelly. Usually, when they are small, all the babies will look like males, but only when they turn to adults, you can actually spot an underbelly, which is a female shrimp. If we can stop the video right here, now, that is a female shrimp. It has a clear underbelly and that's where it carries its eggs and that's how you all can spot a female shrimp. Next let's talk about how do shrimps get buried. Before that a little bit of shrimp anatomy. This is a female shrimp. If you look closely you can spot the ovary. That's where the eggs are being developed. It is called a shrimp saddle since it looks like a saddle on a horseback. If you can spot a saddle on your shrimp, that's where the eggs are getting developed. Sooner or later, that shrimp will be buried. And it is not easy to spot the saddle on Caridina shrimps since most of them have solid colors covering their entire body. It is easily spotted on Neocaridina shrimps and possibly tiger shrimps in Caridina varieties. Once the female shrimp is ready, the female shrimp molds, releasing pheromones into the water. This acts as a signal to the males. The males swiftly try to find the female. The eggs from the female's ovary move down to the hind legs and the male shrimp fertilizes them. And this is how the shrimp get buried. She carries the eggs until they hatch. It takes about 25 to 30 days for all the eggs to hatch, depending on the temperature. The eggs are constantly being fanned until they are ready to hatch. It helps them with oxygen and keeping them clean and ensuring that no mold or bacteria grow on them. And once the shrimp are completely developed, the shrimp lets hatch. If you look closely, you can see the shrimplets hatching. The baby shrimp are an exact replica of their parents. 
when they're born they're very tiny almost less than 3 mm in size and first few weeks are very crucial for shrimplets they should be able to find biofilm or algae and that is what they feed on if there isn't enough food for the shrimplets it is hard for them to survive it is good to provide natural food sources like indian almond leaves mulberry leaves or bee pollen powder or you all can go for baby shrimp food or back to a shrimp let's take 60 days to become juveniles and during that period they constantly graze on food just like the adults juvenile shrimp take about 20 to 30 days to become adults and in some cases the females will take much more longer time to become adults and get buried from the time they are born the shrimp molt and leave the exoskeleton behind that is how they grow as the shrimp gets bigger the color becomes more and more intense and looks more beautiful all shrimp live out their entire life of about 2 years when given them water with right parameters and quality feed and these adults they repeat the cycle they grow up they get buried the young ones hatch and the bigger ones grow up to reach the end of the line that's it for today's video thanks for watching a sub would be great or a thumbs up if you'll have any doubts or any questions you all can leave a comment below thanks for watching catch you in the next one peace